Puff took Tupac blueprint and changed Biggs and Bad Boy in image. I get around. I get around, talked about how fly you was, how many girls you mess with, how many cars you drive, how much money you got, what you willing to do. He took his image. Pac was the first one on the scene wearing Versace shirts. He wouldn't have got the same Versace shirts Pac had. Which, all right, some dudes would do that. You would never catch me wearing something else, something that somebody else got. He was knocking down all the women that he thought Pac was knocking down. And what I mean is having sex with. Why would you want to have sex with women you know for sure a dude that was once cool with you was dealing with? That's that image. Because you got to realize, bro, Puff and Pac was cool at one time. We know this. Mo Prem said that they was going to sign the bad boy. So if he was going to sign the bad boy, it was because of Corey and them. I put that picture on the internet. I put the picture on my channel of Corey Jones. Uh, is Corey Jones, Corey Jacobs? I think Corey Jacobs and Pac right next to each other. Those was the real bad boys of bad boy. You understand? Those are the ones who got the 16, 9, 16 of life sentences that Pac was going to go and be with them first. But then Mo Prem said, when it became just big and puff because Corey then went to jail, he changed his direction. But nobody know why Pac and Puff fell out like they did. You understand what I'm saying? Nobody know why, but Puff had an obsession with him for whatever reason it was, because he started wanting to act. He started wanting to rap. He had an obsession so bad <laughs> that at his Grammy Award winning speech, he used the same speech that Pac used. 